Hey guys, so today's Sunday. Um, yesterday we were super busy at the Muertos Fest here in San Antonio, downtown San Antonio. So today we went to church. Oh, it's my son. <laughs> He's always trying to mess up my videos. Um, but I guess he just adds to them. But um, today we went to church. We got up early. We went for breakfast at this new place that we've never been to called Pancake Joe's. And right now we're going to um, a thrift store by our house over here. I always find good things there, so hopefully we'll find something. And then um, we were going to go to Walmart, I think. And then probably just um, make some vinyl later. But um, tomorrow's Halloween. I can't believe how fast it came this year. Um, it's already that time. Um, unfortunately, I have to work. Um, I didn't get to get the day off because somebody beat me to it. But I'm um, just going to try and make the best of it. When I get off of work, I'm going to come home and just paint my daughter and dress up real quick. And we're just going to probably pass out candy. And my family usually comes over and we'll like order pizza or something. And it's usually pretty fun. So... Yeah, so I'll show you along when we go to the thrift store, see if I find anything. So I am at the thrift store. It is patched. That's the line over there. It's 50% off today. I didn't realize that, but I always find good stuff at this thrift store. So we're going to see what I find. I don't know, there's a lot of people here. I might have came too late. Everything is probably gone now. What, Miranda? That's not your size, Mama. I just bought you a dress. I know. I'm not going to give it to me. Okay. Miranda. Oh, I always find some cool jackets and stuff. Mom, you can't have that. You had it already. Okay, you know I'm gonna have to try this on, guys, because, yes. I'm gonna try that, because it looks cool and shiny. Some cute purses here, they're actually not in bad shape. This is a cute lavender purse and it's not in bad shape at all. That's a cute gift idea. This one's a cute one too. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope y'all are doing good. So today is officially Halloween Eve. So I am wearing my black lipstick that I found at Ulta. Um, I actually I actually did not do a proper unboxing of this but I did a short video on it and I had found this really cute black lipstick from Revolution and it was at Ulta and that's what I'm wearing and I thought it was really really cute it's it's a uh, in the color midnight and it is absolutely gorgeous. Look at the skull that is etched into the lipstick here. And then the really cool thing about it is that this is an actual ring that you can use. Isn't that gorgeous? And it actually, um, it's an adjustable ring so you can adjust it if you need to. 
I don't really adjust it. I haven't worn it yet or anything, but I guess I'll leave it on for the video. It's super cute. Um, I got that a while back at Ulta. They had like a whole little line <clears throat> of stuff, but anywho, I am going to be also drinking this Mountain Dew Zero Sugar Mystery Flavor Cola. And it's a uh, Zero Sugar Limited Edition. I thought it was really cute. My husband bought it at Walmart. And you see the little gravestones and stuff. It looks like really cute for Halloween. So I'm gonna try this. See what color it is. Oh, it's clear. It's just a clear soda. Let the fizzies go down. Sorry, my nails are already coming off on this side. These nails lasted me a long time. I think it's been more than a week and a half, almost two weeks already that I've had these on, but they finally started coming off today, so. <clears throat> oh, carbonation. Hmm. I don't know what that flavor is, but I mean, it's good. Something, caffeine, something. I'll just artificial stuff but I mean it's okay it's just a clear soda some kind of a I'm getting like a fruit fruity type of flavor but I can't put my finger on it but anyway anyway so this is just a little bit of a collective haul from um, TJ Maxx, um, Walmart, um, what else? Uh, the thrift store. Oh, and I do have one thing from Walgreens. I've actually bought a lot, a lot more stuff, but it's uh, stuff that I bought for my daughter. So I wasn't sure if you all guys would be interested in what um, seeing that, but I found her um, Michael Kors coat for the winter super cute and i found her some uh, michael kors uh, pink boots to match and she's already wanting to wear them but it's not it's not cold enough here for that yet but anyway so i guess i'll start off with this here um i actually got this at the thrift store today my husband found um a few really nice shirts um dress dressy shirts and stuff and um he's gonna get them dry cleaned so this came with this with the earrings and they were a dollar 91 and they're like a lavender purple color amethyst color and it's just a long chain i thought it was cute especially for under two dollars and it had it was literally in the tag still and everything so i was like i'm gonna just buy that um Next thing I got, I found at TJ Maxx was this cute Creme Shop Hello Kitty mask. And I think there should be three of them in here. And these are aloe vera and calendula for dewy and plump skin. These were $4.99. Oh, these were at Marshall's. I'm sorry, I forgot. I, I've been going to all kinds of stores lately. Me, my, me and my husband have been going because he was off with me today and then he was off with me on uh, Friday. So we've just been going around and goofing off. The next thing I found, well, actually he found these for me at Marshall's also where the um, de-puffing gel eye masks and these are $4.99 so you can put them in the freezer or the, ref or the refrigerator actually and then you can put them on top of your eyes for depuffing 
and then you can also microwave them if you want um if you want the warmth instead of the cold but i'm definitely going to use these for the um like deep puffing so i'm going to probably probably put them in the refrigerator and then the next thing i found were these cute slippers at ross i thought these were so cute and these were $9.99 and i already tried them on and stuff and they're really comfy but i still have them on the thing here i, I wanted to haul them for you guys before i take them off of the thing and then let me just throw it back there the next thing i found i guess i'll go back to the thrift store because this is the last thing that i found at the thrift store was this really cute bag with bling on it and it says sleep over it's like a little duffel bag and I thought it was really cute. You could use it as a gym bag or of course a sleepover bag, but my uh, kids don't do sleepovers, but my daughter's still too small. But I was thinking we could use this when we go traveling on vacation and stuff. It's just a nice little carry-on bag. And they gave us this for six fifty-six or something like that. I think the girl gave us some discount though, so all the stuff we got was like less than 25 bucks, so she gave us a good deal. But I just thought it was really cute because of the bling. And my daughter loves bling and pink and all that, so. And she's only four. <laughs> so I guess the next thing I will show you is this thing that I found at. Walgreens, yeah. I got this at Walgreens. And it's a squish mil uh squish mellow um yeah squish mellow uh pumpkin pillow and I use him at night. Sometimes my daughter takes him from me, but I love this thing. It's really really soft and I like to sleep with it. Squishmallow and I was so lucky because this is the last one that they had when I went and I found it and I was like yes and somebody had hid it in the back of all the other ones and I and I saw it luckily so got that and then I got a few things from Walmart that I wanted to share with you guys I mean I got a lot of stuff from Walmart but it was like groceries and other stuff and but I just wanted to share a few Christmas things that I got from Walmart and I know it's really early. I hate really. Sh I hate that they already have Christmas stuff up. But I wanted to get my hands on these things now because last year I waited, and then they were sold out by the time I wanted to get one. So I was not gonna take that chance. So I just went ahead and got some stuff. But um, I did find this, and it was in the clearance section at Walmart for a dollar fifty and it's a budget planner. So me and my husband, we wanted to start, you know, um, keeping track of our expenses and stuff because we are really bad with doing that. Um, I was doing it for a while um, last year, but it was just really hard for me to keep up with everything. And, um, but now we really want to start trying to get on top of it again. So I like it because it has all kinds of little different tabs and stuff. So you can keep track of all of your expenses. So hopefully we can do that. And it was only $1.50, so can't beat that. So the next thing I got was this cute Christmas tree. And it was the Grinch. It's a little... 16 inch Christmas tree, isn't it cute? I really wanna do, I, I would like to do a theme of like the Grinch where you have everything, you know, matching and stuff, but I don't know if I can do that, but um, I definitely wanted to get this cause it was super cute, really small, 
I want to put it on one of my tables. And this one was only $15.98. So I definitely had to get that. And then the next thing I got is this cute little mug with the Grinch in it. He's just a little plushy toy. And you know, I love mugs, so I had to get him. And he was $5.98, and he's still connected to the mug. Look at how cute. I love this so much. And um, definitely going to be drinking coffee out of this mug. And then the last thing I wanted to share was this guy the Grinch inflatable and he is five feet tall I think it is yeah five five and a half feet tall so this is the one that I wanted last year but by the time like I said by the time I wanted one I couldn't find them anymore so I went ahead and just picked them up now that they're fully stocked so he was $34.98 isn't he cute? So we'll see how my decorations come out this year. I, um, I'm trying to see if I can maybe get another tree this year. The one that we have is a pre-lit tree. We've had it for years now, but the lights don't work on it anymore. So I always have to wrap it with my own lights and stuff. And it's really old, so... I don't know, I'm thinking about getting a new tree, but we'll see because they're really expensive. So that was it for this video, guys. I hope y'all have a safe Halloween tomorrow. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And leave a comment below on what y'all's plans are for Halloween. I would love to know. Cheers.